Okay. Right now I got hamburger going. I've got some onions cut up to put in there. I already put in some garlic powder and some of that Padilla seasoning. I got the water going for the noodles. Um, I'll put noodles in there and I'll put peas with it. And I have these butter beans. I'm going to make a yummy, yummy butter bean casserole. Stay tuned. Okay. So this is what it looks like before it goes in the oven, which will only be in the oven for 15, 20 minutes. Everything's hot. I just want all the flavors to go together. Now, you can add as many cans of butter beans as you want. I put three in. I love butter beans. I don't care if anybody else don't. They can pick them out. They can pick them out. I grew up eating this stuff. I love it. With a little bit of butter bread. So, all I did is fried the hamburger, put some onion with it, garlic powder, minced garlic, boiled the noodles, and I boiled the peas at the same time because I use frozen. I don't like canned peas. I mix it all together, and that is it. You put whatever seasonings you want on it. And I'm just going to pop it in a 350 oven for about 15 20 minutes, and that's all it needs. Okay, so I just wanted to show you what it looked like on my plate. I'll put a little light on it. Oh, I don't like that light. This stuff is so good. I like to put it on bread and add extra butter. So there's meat, the butter beans. Can't never have enough butter beans. Oh God. I love butter bean casserole. Because that's what they called it. When I was growing up, butter bean casserole. So, if you like it, try it. If you like butter beans, this is absolutely delicious. But, I'm going to go eat. Thanks for watching.